All right, how to vent. A lot of people ask the same questions. Um, this is the hose that comes with the toilet. So on the toilet side, you're just going to take the hose and mount her into the T-bar side. Now, the hard part is mounting to my exterior wall. So it can either go on your sidewall or it can go on um, your roof, um, and different vents will work. I'm going to show you today how to mount our, mount our shell vent. We also sell this on our website, uh, and I'm going to mount it pretending to be on the sidewall. Uh, if you're mounting it to the top roof, we recommend something like the shell vent to have uh, this towards your front and the open side to the back so that you don't backflow air into the toilet. So from the side, uh, a couple key things. I'm going to use, this is an inch and three quarter um, hole saw. And you see I already have my hole, but I'm gonna pretend that I don't. And that's my hole into my wall. Then, I'm going to open up my shell vent. Comes in two pieces here. This is the mount side. So I'm gonna mount this right to my hole. So to get it centered, I'm actually going to use an inch and a quarter PVC. The inch and a quarter PVC lets me go through a, a wall and it actually mounts right up to my shell vent. So let me do that. And then I'm gonna take the screws that come with it. Back my drill bit. I'm going to mount it to my wall. So my inch and quarter, inch and a quarter. PVC. I cut this one down. Uh, depends on the length of your wall. This is obviously representing a really thin wall. Sometimes you get wider walls. Maybe you have two by fours. But an inch and a quarter PVC will mount up to the vent and then perfectly mount up to the end of our hose. So you'll go and there you got a nice tight fit. And there's your hose. Back to the exterior. This is just our cover. We do have our filter, but our cover can go on top. And we have two other screws that are gonna come up underneath to tighten those together. And that is how to install our shell vent. 